All right, all right so uh yeah we're coming back to ai and um in in this video we're gonna be writing some text in here you see where i'm highlighting and basically it's gonna turn into an image and that image is gonna be what we're copying in today's video but in the blocksburg obviously so um if you don't know how text to image ai works basically you just change all these words right here that that, that just mean random stuff and you replace it with something meaningful like a uh, mo modern house and and it'll give you a modern house uh, although it might not be like perfect it, it'll it'll give you an idea of yeah yeah see so yeah basically that's what we're gonna do today in this video uh let me just rename the plot so i know what that is ai house challenge all right so yeah obviously that first ai house does not count uh i'm just gonna just generate a house and hopefully we get a good one so that way i don't have to like you know try too hard and hopefully it's small enough so i don't have to take that much time because you know i'm a lazy builder and if you want to try this out for yourselves uh i'll leave the link to the ai in the description below oh well i, I yeah that's not it that is not it yeah never mind i'm just gonna go through a ton of them and hopefully i get a good one because this is definitely not a one-story modern home and i definitely don't want to be recreating whatever the heck this is no no and no uh no what is happening with that car okay what the heck am i even generating at this point i swear i'm putting one floor modern house and it's just not giving me a one floor i mean it's all right but i can't work with it <gasps> oh my god okay the car is kind of messed up but i think this is it okay i just had to make sure i downloaded the image so that way i wouldn't lose it but yeah get ready to be amazed i'm gonna make this thing in blocksburg uh how do i make this thing in blocksburg okay well i mean i guess we could start with some very simple uh wall structures um there's like a really large middle wall that's what i've realized yeah as you can see where my cursor is hovering over um it's this white thing but from here on i i have no idea what i'm supposed to do but honestly this isn't too bad as for the interior i don't know if i'm gonna do the interior i'm just gonna try my best to get the exterior first because this looks like a jumbled mess like what are these shapes on the left especially like what how am i supposed to make a window that looks like that well i mean i guess this is a an okay start so i'll just keep building i guess see yeah this left side is really weird but i think i got most of the garage thing done hold on let me just pair this up with the actual image that we're working with hold on let me get a door in so that way we can see where the door is boom door yeah are, are we seeing are we seeing the um uh, yeah we're not seeing it I, I don't even know what's on the left side but i'm not gonna worry about that because it doesn't look like a solid thing it looks like like a, a a balcony thing so so i'll deal with that later but anyways i think the i think the important part is to get the main structure done and i honestly have no idea if there are windows out at the front but i'm just gonna put windows anyway because like you gotta love some windows yeah 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 i don't see windows anywhere that look like that but we're just gonna leave them there honestly i might switch to using this like really big modern window i feel like that would fit a little better so instead of those three on the left i'm just gonna put uh i don't know if i like that okay the floor in the original image um is kind of basic i'm not gonna lie and it literally just goes like this so i'm just gonna leave it as is you know i'm gonna i'm gonna make some changes um just some like uh personal personal preferences no nothing too big just like a couple floor elevations and then and maybe um everything else i mean i want to get some gardening in first because um this is looking very bare right now and then i know there isn't much gardening in the original image or the ai generated image but i'm just gonna do this anyways because i think it looks cool i'm not gonna lie maybe most of the things in this video are just gonna be me saying it because it looks cool because i have no idea where i'm going with this especially with the ai very uncertain but uh i'm just gonna keep it going honestly for the entire honestly for the entire build to even look remotely good i think i'm gonna have to put a little spin on it just to like blocksburg fi it i don't even know if that's a word that that's definitely not a word actually what i mean by blocksburg fi is uh or where is it blocksburg if i anyways um uh, what i mean by that is um i need to make it so it works in the game and what i mean by works in the game is that it looks good in the game but at this point i have no idea what i'm doing so uh don't bear with me i guess we could say this is a pretty solid wall so i'm just gonna raise the roof on this for now that's a pretty good height so i'm just gonna leave it there now there's an overhang right here and i don't know how to go about doing that maybe just like this would do oh okay that that looks pretty accurate not gonna lie now the challenging part is figuring out um what exactly goes on every other side of the wall like we're only given 
find an image of the front oh and it looks pretty good uh but anyways uh what, what was i saying yeah we're only given an image of the front so it's a bit difficult to really picture what anything else looks like obviously you, you can imagine it but like you know that's not part of the challenge now as for this uh second floor thing that i kind of wanted to do but don't know how to do i might just do that it doesn't look too bad you know at first i really wanted to use basic shapes but i feel like that just wouldn't work you know honestly the closest we're probably gonna get is um just doing this i mean yeah this looks really derp i mean if the AI told me to do it, I, it has to look good, right? The AI is never wrong. Or that's usually what I believe when I use it for my essay. Anyways, I'm just gonna keep building and hopefully this turns out well. I mean, this is so funky. I've never seen a house shape like this. What the heck am I doing? Yeah, at this point, what even is this? What is that shape? Why is there just wall? I don't get it. You know what I might add? Okay, hear me out. I'm gonna place a basic shape right here, smack dab in the middle of this blank space not a taylor swift reference by the way and then i'm just gonna resize it so then it looks yeah i'm just gonna keep it like that i have no idea what i'm gonna do for the left side and now all we have to do is simply put a roof on this bad boy oh god this is like borderline atrocious or i mean it's not too bad but like it could be better i really hate the left side i don't know what it is about the left side. i hate the left side so much it just doesn't work like all all of the rights if you cover up the left side the right side looks good everything else sucks it is what it is whatever just keep working at this point i just gotta finish the shell and start decorating some stuff so that shouldn't be too difficult and plus you can pretty much mimic whatever i've done on the front side to the back side so what I'm saying is that you can take that whole wall or just segment and put it there and then we can take that and smash it to the ground Okay, now that we've got most of the AI part done. So like what the AI has generated I'm just gonna do the coloring and then make some tweaks to the gardening man i really hate the left side i don't like the left side it's so off like even even in this picture it looks so off i i don't even know what it is should i should i try i'm not gonna try making the car what the heck okay so i've added a bit of gardening and it's at least starting to look a little better like oh my god i hate the left side just wondering if there's like anything i can do to the left side to make it look not as derp like maybe i could raise the roof here but then again that's not like the ai challenge part whatever the ai generated is so ugly Ellie. Like, i'm not gonna lie i mean the right side looks okay whatever i'm just gonna leave it at this because this is pretty much everything the ai has done i mean this entire left side with the gardening isn't even part of the ai and i don't even know if that's legal for me to do i'm just gonna do some other extra stuff and then i guess we can start working on the inside i mean i don't think i'm gonna spend too much time on the inside it's not too important i'm not too worried about that the main challenge is to get the exterior shell done and it looks so hideous with the left side i actually maybe maybe if i color it yeah yeah yeah. maybe maybe if i maybe if i color it it'll it'll look better uh it does not look better i mean if you cover the left side it looks fantastic hold on let me just cover the see it looks fantastic without the left and then it just looks trash whatever whatever i'm just gonna keep it there because ai is amazing maybe maybe these are like some of the limitations of ai like obviously you can make amazing stuff with your essays but aside from that there are always gonna be some flaws that i hate god i hate that left side well i'll just get the lighting in i mean like surely you guys can let me cheat and just fix the left side look would you look at that it looks 10 times better already you know what i'm just gonna leave it like that nobody can tell me otherwise you know honestly i kind of like this um what what's this called just just the white part okay okay Okay, okay. And you know what? We're just gonna do a couple more shenanigans with it. I know this is completely not AI, but like, you know, I, I used AI for like the main part of the house. So I, I, I did that much. Okay, hear me out. I'm doing some architecture stuff, but I guess you can't call it architecture stuff when there's no meaning behind it. I mean, I guess there's intention. I, I'm making it look pretty. Yeah, nobody's believing that. Look at what Isaac can do when he's not forced to do things by AI. Such a, what a guy. Well, I'm not gonna make this go on for too long. So to divide this up, how do we divide this up? We're gonna use a bunch of doors at the back because that's usually what I do. So yeah, slide sliding doors this will be probably the living room and then on the right you might be able to enter through a little corridor to the kitchen this can be a bathroom why not put a nice little window in here as well you can um uh 
Look at the plants when you um uh, pee. Yeah, this is gonna lead into the kitchen. The kitchen is gonna go along this wall, and then we'll have left and right sides. And then on the right will be bedroom. Huh, nice and simple. Everything actually worked out pretty well. Surprising. I actually have no idea how I just did that. Okay, basic shape hack number 504. Um, if your ceiling looks like this and it has a bunch of lines, all you gotta do is use a basic shape, resize it, and transform it up. Nothing difficult. Plus, it acts as like a a a, a passage, a core door passage i won't lie though this little white um i won't lie though this white addition is l a little annoying when it comes to building but we can work around that it's okay oh yeah one last thing i should probably add is uh the vehicle now what vehicle do i want to add for that the buggy oh wait no i forgot i'm, I'm rich now so I, I don't have to worry about how much money i'm spending uh why can't why can't i access inventory uh, it's okay i don't need a car anyways let's get this floor in and then we can start furnishing this i don't know how hard i'm gonna try and furnish this then again when do i ever try i'll just do the usual i feel like we should not go with linen but i feel like there's a bit too much linen here but at the same time like what other color is there to use for floor Eh, whatever i'll i'll leave this for now i'll just double it up i'll probably come back later and just you know change it but for now this will do oh yeah i also gotta change the colors of the trees because colors mean something okie dokie and there we go right so for the interior i think i'm just gonna do the same thing i did with the exterior and i'm gonna put a little prompt in here just so i can generate and and keep the entire ai idea so i've got this modern living room thing and i don't know how i'm supposed to fit it into the build but i'm gonna try to do it anyways i mean it can't be that hard i mean like actually where am i supposed to put the tv well i mean i guess i could put a fireplace here and then start building from it but i don't know how i'm supposed to build from it really i'd say i literally just have to yellow it i don't know man i'll figure out something of course i feel like it's not a faulty build without the the, the classic plant so I'm just gonna put that here. I mean, it's looking good so far. Kind of. Maybe. Not really, but like, it's coming along. Okay, so I've got some stuff done and it kind of looks like the image, but not really. I put a little twist on it, obviously, because, you know, it's not as easy to build image for image. But I'm just gonna keep adding some more decorations to this until it looks like the finished product. Honestly, it's not looking too bad. It's just It just needs a couple of tweaks. Okay, and that should be our living room pretty much all done. I just gotta color it, but I can probably do that later. Uh, I don't know about the color scheme once again. I actually don't know if I said this, but like i don't know if i should use the color scheme that they're going for here or not i honestly have no idea so i'm just gonna leave it for now but anyways we can move on to the kitchen and 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 i don't know dining room okay so this is the kitchen design that they want me to go for huh um i i guess it's doable there are no cabinets which i'm a little concerned about i don't know where i'm supposed to put all the all the stuff but i'm just gonna try and follow this image as close as possible okay so here's what i've got so far uh the fridge is gonna go on the right and then i'm gonna have a stove right here uh where's the stove all right i'm gonna put the stove there and then in the middle we're gonna have a, a counter island this just goes on the right side this goes on the left side sick and that's floating oh no okay now we get our cabinets in or i mean like our floating cabinets at least and then we gotta do this random basic shape in the in the roof or in the ceiling for some reason because that that was in the ai generated image as well so i might as well add that and then i could put like a bunch of lights in there why not and then we could just line this place up with chairs and then that should be it for our kitchen can't forget the carpet <clears throat> oh or the sink because i somehow always forget a sink and i near i nearly forgot the sink again oh my god okay then i guess that'll do for our kitchen um not sure what it's missing it's got some appliances on there so i'll probably add those uh, off camera or something oh the stove is on the island i mean that's not a problem i could do that later but aside from that all i have to do is color this linen now and everything else now the backdrop or like the backsplash at least is is a kind of reflective metal and and I don't think we have that in Bloxburg at least. So I'm just gonna replace it with some white marble and leave it at that. Just gotta paste a couple more lights because it's very dark in here. Okay, and then for our dining room, I think I'm just gonna wing it with whatever table I want. So since we've got something modern, I'm just gonna rotate this square one and then put a bunch of chairs around it and then call it a day. Okie dokie. And it might also be a good idea to put some storage here just because there's no storage in the kitchen so far. Oh yeah, also I added a piano here just because I thought it would fit. And I think it does fit, just like it doesn't fit. 
it, but at the same time it fits. Yeah, whatever. I don't make a lick of sense, but it's okay. I've just realized how much wood there is in this entire build. I mean, it's what the AI told me, so uh, can't say much about that. I mean, I guess we could obviously add some color with these books. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Okay, and then we could just copy this shelf over to here because why not? Okay, not looking too bad. Yeah, there is a very unhealthy amount of wood in this entire build. I'm just gonna leave it. Also, uh, bathroom. How do I do a bathroom? I'm gonna skip that for now and just hit the household. I'm just gonna put two dryers and or wait, no, what, what was it? One dryer, one washer in here. And then that should be good for this room. Uh, maybe also some like laundry baskets and whatnot, of course. Can't be living in a dirty home. There we go. And I don't know if I can squeeze some storage in there. I'm probably not going to. I'll just add a painting and then that should be good. There we go. Anything else in the household I could probably add? Maybe an ironing board. Actually, I don't think that fits. I'll put a carpet in here and that should be fine. Maybe resize it so it's not too big. There we go. Okay, that's the washing machine room or the, the laundry. Yeah, yeah the laundry room. I definitely did not call it the washing machine room. Okay, now on to our final three, four rooms. Two are gonna be bedrooms, two is gonna be, uh, wait, how, how does this work? This one's gonna be a bathroom, this one's gonna be a bathroom, and then two bedrooms. Okay, sweet. So for this bathroom, I'm gonna put a shower in here, as well as probably a toilet. Hope I can fit a toilet. If not, that'll be a little bit of a problem. Yeah, this is definitely not the best place to put a toilet, but, uh, maybe a sink? Okay, yep, sink will have to do. Now, I don't know if I should put a window on this wall. Probably not the best idea, but like at the same time, why not? <laughs> of course, we can't forget our toilet paper every time I do. So I'm just going to put that in right now. And I think that should be good for our bathroom. I might put like a little storage thing up here. And maybe, maybe not. Oh yeah, I can't forget our towels. There is a shower in here, so we cannot not have towel. Okay, towels under the sink. And then we also need a hand drying towel. Perfect. There is our bathroom all done. And I will paint that later. Now, as for our first bedroom, it's obviously going to need a bed. But I don't know how I'm supposed to put the bed really. Because the, the room's awkward. Awkwardly I mean, the, the room's not awkwardly shaped. It's the windows. They're awkwardly placed. And I don't think I can fit a double bed. So I'm just gonna use two twin size beds. And y you know, it works kind of maybe. I wish you could resize beds. That, that would be so cool. Now in the bedroom, I'm gonna put a little desk area so we can work on our homework. Because I've got homework to do after this. That's probably why I'm rushing this, honestly. But you gotta know what comes first. You gotta know what comes first. Um, Should I put a laptop or a computer in here? I'm gonna put a laptop up in here and we could just drag some books over why not honestly I have no idea how I'm, how I'm gonna lay out this bedroom maybe paintings like that and then a storage unit that could work okay that's an interesting design I'll just leave it like that because I think it looks okay and then as for where we put our clothes I'll just put two wardrobes right here side to side by side it is a bit cramped but you know uh I'm skinny it'll work I think okie dokie and then we're gonna do this little trick I used before I'm just gonna put two uh wall lights wherever the wall lights our cylindrical wall lamps right here and right here right next to the bed and i don't know if we're gonna be able to fit end tables but i'm gonna try anyways if it doesn't work it doesn't work and i'll just leave the lights i mean i guess it works i mean th this door is gonna be very not right but it'll work or i could just move the door like a smart man okay that works bedroom number one complete now bedroom number two bedroom number two is extremely small i have no idea I actually this is probably the size of my dorm room i'm not gonna lie so i can't really be complaining about size I'm just gonna slam the bed in front of the what's it called the window. I feel like this this will work Just resize the carpet a little and that should that should be okay And then we're just gonna copy one of the wardrobes over to here as well as one of the plants We're not gonna have a lot of room in here So I have no idea how I'm gonna put a bunch of stuff I guess we could copy another storage unit over here and then in the other corner We could probably just have like an instrument maybe a ukulele. Oh wait. No, that's an acoustic guitar What am I saying? Okay bedroom number two done. Um, uh, yeah, those are very very simple so i'm not gonna yeah don't judge me it's also gonna be another game of copying and pasting things because now that now i've got like every basic thing done i swear this is what all my videos turn out to be in the end i don't know why you guys watch me <laughs> this is also probably the worst layout for a bathroom i have ever seen it's 
Okay. Okay, you know what? I'm switching the shower. I think this corner shower would fit a bit more than the other one. Yeah, definitely. 100%. Okay, and then we just copy and paste everything that we had over here into the other room. This is such a faulty build. Oh my god. Okay, that should be it. Time to color. And the coloring process should not take long. I'll probably skip it until the end because, uh, you guys really want to watch me color? You guys know how bad my coloring is. Yeah, I'll just leave this for the end. And we can cut back, uh, in a bit. I think this is the first time in a really 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 long time that i've actually used a color that isn't linen for wood like i'm using a weird kind of brown right now i mean maybe it's a good thing maybe it's not a good thing okie dokie and that should be it for all of the coloring this is the ai house pretty much all done let's do the tour so ai house actually did not turn out very bad as you can see the exterior looks somewhat decent um that's probably because i tweaked the left side because the left side at the beginning was absolutely hideous um if you guys have the time try and count how many times i've dissed the left side of the house oh god what what is that <laughs> but anyways i'm not gonna bother trying to fix that because i i have homework to do this is probably the worst youtuber excuse to stop recording but yeah anyways let's go through the tour i have not changed the decals which is a bit of a problem all right stepping up to the house we have a very generic driveway it is um it is square it, it is it's got it's generic but yeah stepping up we have our little car park area this doesn't even extend to over where the cars park so that's a bit of a problem but anyways stepping on inside through the front door we have our living room couch tv fireplace plant random plant plant on the table and uh, that's pretty much it uh, this table is not painted. I'll, I will be back. And now all of a sudden the table is painted. Wow, what happened there? Okay, anyway, stepping on through this little archway. Th it's not really an archway. It's like a, an opening. Stepping through there, we have our kitchen. Very nice and plain. I mean, AI. Haha. <laughs> AI generated, not me being lazy. And then over to your right, you have your dining table and a bit of storage at the back, which is definitely not copied and pasted from over here, uh, where we have a giant black piano. It, it, there's no yellow. I'm, I'm so sorry. Uh, uh, but anyways over here we also have a bathroom with a shower and two very large windows for other people to stalk you through uh and then back here you have your sink and a toilet and that's pretty much mimicked over here as well oh yeah we have some storage here and then a bunch of doors opening out to the backyard but yeah over here we have two bedrooms and two wait two bedrooms one bathroom uh here's our master bedroom which isn't really master at all because the beds are kind of together uh we've got a desk area and we've also got storage space for our clothes um it's very very cramped in here which is not my problem uh but on to the other side we have another bedroom a different color but it's pretty much got all of the same furniture items except the ukulele i mean uh the the acoustic guitar so that's pretty normal and then over here you have your bathroom which is uh definitely not a copy of the other one i mean you've got your curb shower and 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 yeah yeah it's pretty much the same as the other one anyways that's pretty much it for oh wait i thought this was a door to the exit yeah 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 ai ai house i love ai god i need it for my assignment